core. The reactor will reach a supercritical state in T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of Subnautica. That was actually one of the things I wanted to do this episode. I was here just getting ready to get a few things taken care of, getting ready to start recording, and the countdown started, so I thought I'd start the, start the show with a bang. But anyways, there's a few things I want to do today, is I want to try to get some more exploring done, see if we can start getting some some uh, habitat, habitat stuff going, so we can get a base going. Uh, I think... It, I first want to say thank you for everybody that's been offering tips and suggestions in the comments. I really appreciate it. Uh, this isn't my first time actually seeing the game, so I do understand basic stuff, but there are things that I will need to come to you guys for help once in a while, like uh, dropping stuff. Oh, that's Yeah, that's the right one. Uh, I didn't know about dropping. It doesn't actually show here, but if you're outside, you can actually drop stuff. Uh, someone had mentioned about despawning, about uh, items not despawning in early access, well, stuff actually despawns now. I've already tried dropping a little bit of table cor coral down here, and... No, that one actually showed up. The other ones I dropped didn't actually show up. But I don't know if they'll despawn, but we will test that out. But, uh, what I want to do is, we never actually did finish that one off. So let's head back over there and see what we got. Oh, do I have a battery on me? No, I do not. Let's go make a battery first. Alright, let's get that out of my face. And let's see what we need for battery. Uh, let's see, battery we need... Well, it's a power cell. We need ash mushrooms. And I should have some. Or maybe not. Alright, back in the hole we go. Good thing they're, like, right here. Alright, let's go back up. Let's get some juice. Alright, uh, let's see, yes, this. Yeah, I was a little concerned, a little confused about the aurora. I thought it was, I, heard, I thought it was supposed to be like two hours in game that it finally goes, and I'm only like an hour 20 on this playthrough, if that. But anyways, uh, let us go. Uh, let's see, where's that light bod? Let's go over here. I know I should be saving my batteries, but hey, we've got plenty of mushrooms, plenty of copper, might as well use it, right? Uh, let's see what we're going to find here. I'm pretty sure I went here. There's something about their sea glide damage. I don't know if I have to actually repair it or what I got to do. I also do want to keep an eye out for scannables. Another thing I want to do today, since the aurora is already blown up, I want to probably should make that radiation suit and start looking for the sea moth. Because I do believe the sea moth is somewhere around the Aurora. All right, let's get that out of here so we can save the battery. We don't need titanium. And I'm pretty sure I was in this one already, was I not? Oh, no, I wasn't. All right, um, I will look, start reading those eventually once I start to get the place set up. What is that? Compass. I have no idea what that is. So is this beacon gone now? Is there nothing else in here? Nope, of course not. Now the beacon should be gone. Yes, it is. All right, let's head back to Z Pod. Actually, yeah, let's go back to the pod and make radiation suit. And I'm gonna just kill this battery. Okay, I like how to do a battery change when you're running from something that wants to eat you. And I'll probably look at trying to get, probably look at trying to get, uh, there we go, now it's dead. Uh, the recharging pins, wherever they may be. Oh wow, they really did take the whole front end of that ship off. I never noticed it was like uh, before and after of it. Well, the coral's still there, we'll see how long that stays. I did drop some stuff, but I was like just below the pod, so maybe it's floated away. It's hard to say, but let's see what we need for this radiation suit. Uh, compass, we need fish, miber, and lead. Ew. 
So we've got to find lead now. All right, fair enough. So let's... Uh, I need one more of those for the fiber mesh, I do believe. Let's see here. Yes, and how many fiber mesh do I need for the radiation suit? Two, so I need three more creep vines and some lead. Let's see if I've got any space I can make here. And no. And, uh, yeah, I didn't know that food actually decomposed, so I'll have to keep an eye on that, too. Anyway, let's go down here. Let's drop our, uh, our rotting hollow fish. See where he lands. Eh, he's fine. Anyway, let's uh, do some exploring. Let's uh, look for stuff. I have absolutely no idea where I'm supposed to find lead or anything really. But let's head off this direction and pray to God the uh, radiation doesn't kill me. So let's look for some more croppings, shall we? Yeah, I guess we'll start scanning a few things while we're at it. We'll scan them up. We'll check them out later. Something to do while it's dark. Come here, you. All right. I gotta get better fins to be able to scan these guys. Alright. Aha! Gotcha. Ooh, another creature egg. Not that I really need them. I, uh, I thought I had done the mushrooms. Uh, beacon. Yeah, let's go up and get some air. Should probably look at getting a better oxygen tank. Oh, once I get the sea moth, I shouldn't have to worry about it too much. What is that? Nothing. Anything to scan? Any goodies? Probably not. I probably already have explored this wreckage already. Yes, there's a sea glide. And more stuff I don't need. Alright, let's get some air. And. And, like I said, we're gonna head off in this direction. And just see what we can find. Let's uh, change the battery on this. I do change. Yeah. Ah, I gotcha. I gotcha. Just had to figure it out. Now I gotta get some air. Okay, let's go. Okay, we don't need those. Let's see if we can find. Hmm. Still curious about where to find the lead. What is? Ooh, we got some more wreckage here. Anything worth scanning? Junk, nuclear waste disposal. Sure, why not? No idea what it's for, but we'll find out eventually. Nothing here to scan, no. No. Let's go up. And I do hear something, I don't know if that's something trying to get to me, or something's gonna blow up, or if it's just me. All right, get a full supply of oxygen, and let's go back down. See what else we can find down here. Ooh, lots of scambles. Nice. Nothing in there. Nothing over there. Let's see what we got over here. More titanium. Don't really need it at the moment. Nothing in there. Let's see what else we can find. Doo -doo -doo. Where is that Aurora? Now we're getting close. Get more wreckage. All right, back to the surface. Let's see how much air we can get. Not bad. Good ten feet. All right, let's go look over here. Oh, all right. Let's not go that way then.
All right. Let's go look for some lead, shall we? So if I were lead, would it be, make sense to have it close to where you need it? Oh, what did I drop? Come on, where are you? Copper. Copper. Titanium. Let's see what else we got. It's a peeper. And a bladderfish and a boomerang and lions and tigers and bears. Oh my. Oh, there's another one. Copper. I need lead. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hmm. I do know there are certain areas you gotta find it. Like, um, like different biomes that you find certain minerals from. Okay. And I'm pretty sure I'm in the wrong area looking for lead, but hey, that's all about exploring. Getting yourself in dangerous situations for no reason at all. More titanium. Titanium. T copper. More of these eggs. And a crash fish, I think. So let's get out of here. Oh, wait. Some air down here. Come here. Thank you. So, what else we got down here? All right, so I wanted to mention something about seeing the scan thing in the corner, and I do see that now. I uh, think you can point that out. I guess that helps with uh, stuff that you've already scanned. If you've already scanned it, then it probably doesn't show up. And that little guy scared the hell out of me. All right, let's go up. So I'm wondering if maybe I gotta go back to around the pod to find find lead. Where is it? There it is. All right, let's uh, let's keep on moving. What I think what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna do a cut until I actually find some lead, and I'll bring you back when it's time to make some radiation protection. So I came back to life pod here just to try to get some inventory space because I need to say my inventory is crap, and I don't want to waste any resources on these lockers. But I found a message here, so let's play it. So I guess that's the island that's close by. All right, so that is a long ways away. I guess that's 300 meters down and a little ways away. So that being said, let's uh, get back out and see what we can do. Uh, maybe I should make some. I don't know if I should make some titanium lockers or if I should just drop this titanium because I've got so much of it. And maybe it'll stay there, who knows. But anyways, I shall bring you back when I find something interesting. Okay, so I cheated a little bit. I looked it up. Apparently I gotta be down below 50 meters and look for sandstone, not limestone. So let's go brave the creep vine clusters. Watch out for those. Those no good stalkers. Now, is there any croppings out here or uh, clusters? Because I am low enough. Nothing on here. And probably going to be all down here, so I need to go and get some air. And then we got it back down. I was looking at the, the next oxygen tank level too, and I gotta find silver, which I think we can actually find down here. I was watching somebody else do a little bit of an LP before, and he found it over here by the creek vines. So let's go check it out, shall we? Yeah, let's get that out of the way, and that's probably it right there, right? 
Oh, look at that. Got lead right away. Awesome. Okay, I do have to watch out for those guys. So, he's over there. I'm going to stay over here. And just see if I can find something. What are you on your quartz? Don't care about you too much. I will have to actually grab a few of these. 30 seconds. Oh, and I'm out of oxygen. So let's run back up. I actually need that for the radiation suit. And back down we go. Uh, I always get nervous coming down into that like that. Alright, I need... Probably you. That's uh, limestone. Hmm. Let's go over here and see what we can find. Oh, maybe not over there, because he's over there. So let's stay out of his way and maybe he'll stay out of mine. I highly doubt that, but we can always hope. What are you? Salt. Don't care about salt. I want silver. Silver and lead. I don't know what that is, but I'm pretty sure I've gotten that already. And... I'm actually so glad I don't actually feel these things as I'm swimming through them. What are you? Oh, another creature egg. Anything in here? Probably not. Ooh, cave. I need sandstone. And I'm getting too high up for it. Okay. Hello, Mr. Stalker. I'm going to stay out of your way. You can go and play with the rubble all you want. Oh, you're an interesting one. Probably should scan you, but... Oh, there's always time for scanning later. Oh, I wonder if that's sandstone there. That's an interesting rock outcropping. Not very often you find stuff like this just naturally forming like that. Titanium. That's limestone, I don't care. I want sandstone, which means I'm gonna have to go down into the bad area. Which I do not want to go in. That's limestone, there we go. Silver! Oh my god, my inventory is full. Come on, where's that silver? Thank you. Let's get up. Alright, so I think I just need... can't remember how much lead I needed for the thing. But I have one lead, I have one silver, I think that's all I needed. I think I need one more lead. So let's go see if we can find this thing. Because I want to start exploring. Or at least around the Aurora. Let's get that out so I'm not ch killing my battery. Whoa! Okay, I'm out of here. I hear you loud and clear. Alright, I just need one more lead. Oh, what are you? No, oh, I already got you. Don't care. Ooh, ooh, jellies. Gold. I found gold. At least I think that was gold. Anything? Uh, oh, what are you? I think that was more silver. And I think I have a stalker on my ass. Somewhere. Yep. Oh, it's right. Okay, that was close. Alright, I just need one more lead. One more lead. One more lead and one less stalker. What are you? I already got you. Again, if you have something scanned already, you shouldn't be able to have to scan be able to scan it again. Is that limestone? Yes. Let's go down here. There's sandstone. Lead. Aha. Let's get rid of that. No, that's not what I wanted. Where is my lead? 
All right. Let's head back to the surface, back to the pod, and get a radiation suit. Now, where are you? There you are. We're about half a K away, so I'll bring you back when we're inside. Okay, I made it back. So, yeah, the coral's still there, all that titanium's still there. It's actually a nice little holding spot, so maybe we'll take advantage of that for now. But, let's go ahead and... no, no beacons. So, let's see what we can make here. We need... Uh, what was I doing? I was making a high capacity oxygen tank. I need four titanium and my tank. So, ooh, I gotta do inventory juggling here. Hmm. I thought I grabbed three of those. Yeah, I will get to you in just a minute. Need to make fiber mesh. And I need to make get one more of them. So let's put that, take that out, put that in there. What else did I need? I needed titanium. Three titanium. I actually have to take my oxygen tank off if I have room for it. And uh, no, I don't, because it takes six. So we'll put. Uh, let's actually drink that. I made cooked up some bleach and uh, made some of that. Uh, disinfected water because I was running low and uh, yeah I'm getting a little confused here there we go high capacity oxygen tank and there we go so that gives me 90 seconds oxygen now 135 so less chance of dying so now let's go and uh, get one more creep line where are the creep vines? Geez, you'd think I'd be able to figure this out by now. But no. I have bad sense of direction, especially in the ocean. Alright. Oh, that's the wrong one. Right. Come on, hotkeys. There we go. Okay, we'll take three, just in case. And let's go get our radiation suit. All right, let's go ahead and see. If we need one more fiber mesh. And where is it? Oh, yeah, because I. Put it away. That's right. Okay, now we have. Where is it? There we go. Radiation suit. And we'll get to that message in a moment. Oh, it actually gives you gloves and a helmet, too. Well, that's cool. So let's see what this says. This is Avery Quinn of Trading Ship Sunbeam. Aurora D. Reed. Over. Another the vacuum. These Altera ships. They run low on engine grease, they send an SOS. You offer to help, they don't pick up. Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. It's gonna take more than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Over. Well, I'm sure once you get here, you we'll try them again tomorrow. Danny mm -hmm. Charter's gonna have us blowing our credits, running errands for Altera. Yeah. I'm sure by the time you guys get here, you're gonna get shot out of the sky by the big giant gun that's sitting on this island planet all right uh yeah let's make some inventory space here if i can not a whole lot i can do uh, i think that's the only thing we actually need that for so i'm gonna go ahead and make a mesh just because it's not like we can't get more okay now let's uh get that in there uh don't really need any more copper, so we'll keep an eye on that. Uh, drink some water and let us go. I gotta start gathering up some food too. Maybe let's actually get the crab trap going just because. So, what do I need for it? I need titanium. Not a problem. So, I don't know if this thing actually holds a charge, it has to be recharged or what, but. Let's do it, because i got to start getting some food going. 
All right, where are we gonna put it? Let's put it right here. Okay, I guess it doesn't need to have an external power source. I guess it doesn't have to get recharged. So, do I have inventory space? I do. Let's grab some food. Grab a peeper and two and... God, these things are hard to get. I don't know if we can actually eat the boomerangs. Or this guy here. I don't think we can pick this guy up. No, we can't. So let's go grab some, oh, whole fish. Where's that whole fish? There you are. Come here, you. All right, let's go, uh, let's go cook some food. Probably shouldn't really cook so much. Then again, though, we can, we can also dehydrate this stuff too. Probably be a little bit better. Good eating around the fins. Yummy. Alright, we'll make, uh, we'll make two. And we'll go ahead and eat them. Alright, so. I'm sure the peeper can stay in my inventory. Let's, uh, head back to the Aurora. And of course, it's getting dark, so this is gonna be fun. Do I have another battery on me? I do. Good. Probably should come back when it's light out. It's going to be impossible for me to find anything. Now it's going to watch out too because I think the Reaper hangs around here, doesn't he? Yeah, I think we're going to have to come back when it's light out. It's a little too dark to see anything. See what's quickly over here. See if there's anything of interest, anything worth scanning, anything that's going to make my life easier. Who am I kidding? This is the real world. Uh, let's go see where we are. Oh, we're right there. Okay, we are close. So we are getting wreckage laying around. Good. I want to start finding modules though. Find stuff I can start building. Well, definitely gonna have enough titanium when the time comes. So, and I'm not seeing anything we're standing yet. Not close enough to the ship, probably. Whoa. Where the hell were you? It was freaky. Where is the Aurora again? Oh, it's right there. It's kind of hard not to see that. Yeah, I can't see nothing. It's too dark. What else we got? Is there anything? Any wreckage anywhere? Like we are right at the damn thing. Oh, speaking of wreckage. Anything here? Nothing worth scanning. Not in this pile. And nothing there. Now what's that light for? Oh my god, that scared me. <laughs> Who would have thought a bre breach would scare the hell out of you? Okay, we're actually right at the Aurora. Okay. And I'm not seeing anything except for a stalker who just wants to play, but I'm not interested. Oh my god, that thing's just rumbling. Uh, I don't find anything up here, maybe it's down lower. How do you get that stupid thing off? That uh, topographical map. I didn't realize I was going that far down. Alright, well, let's 
go back to the other side and see what we'll find. Looks like the sun's coming up, so should be seeing something soon. Uh, seeing a little more anyways. What is that? Probably a whole, yeah, a whole bunch of lead. But I think I need the prawn suit to get that stuff. Not that it matters, I don't know what I need lead for right now. I got my rad suit, that's all that matters. And that breaching scared the hell out of me again. You know, it's funny, when you're in the dark depths of the ocean, even though we're only 20 meters down, the simplest little things can just get your heart racing. So, do we have anything over here? Nothing. Oh, I'm sure there's lots of stuff, I just don't see it. I somehow don't feel safe being underneath this thing right now. Or being in front of that guy. Let's get out of here. Hopefully he won't chase me. Yeah, I keep hitting space to go up and that's what's causing me to breach like that all the time because I don't realize I'm not paying attention to how close I am to the surface. Oh, he looked hungry. Don't worry, I'm out of your way. Oh, he's still chasing me. That's fine. For now, until my battery runs out. Really? I'm not finding anything to scan. But we have sun, which is good. Yeah, I don't want to go in there. Hey, a Cyclops fragment. Alright. One of ten million to go. Do I only need three pieces for the Cyclops? Is that all I need? I always figured the Cyclops would be like ten different things you had to get and three different things you had to get for each thing. I know it's not the case, but Ooh, what do we have in here? Power cell? Okay. What else we got? Oh, what are you? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, out of here. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah, I didn't realize it was that close to me. Let's get the hell out of here. Okay. So... So what, do I just really only need... Oh, no, 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 yeah, Cyclops bridge, Cyclops engine, probably Cyclops hull, Cyclops this, Cyclops that. So like I said, yeah, it is going to be like 20, 20 different things I'd have to get. Oh, go away. Oh, yes, get away, get away, get away, get away. I have no idea where I am, I'm lost. I'm lost, I'm being hunted. You still chasing me? No. Why is it so murky down there? That is a big ship. <laughs> oh my god, it's so murky, I can't see anything. And let's go up to the back end of the ship on the other side and see what we can find. It's just so murky, I can't see anything. Maybe it's telling me I'm not supposed to be on this side. Wow, I didn't know they could jump out of the water like that. That is messed. Okay, well, let's head back to clear waters and see what else we can find. Uh, I just want to check something here. Uh, blueprints. Let's actually show us what we have for the Cyclops. Yes. So, we need, yeah, we're going to need a lot of parts of the Cyclops by the looks of it. Change your battery. No, oh, what you didn't change? 
Uh, yes, you did. What? Oh, because I've got no batteries. <laughs> that makes sense. Alright, uh, let's get out of here and get that out of my face. And now that we can see, let's see if there's anything else we can scan. Right now, I'd be happy to find a locker. But I somehow don't think that's going to be a possibility. Okay, Mr. Stalker, I'll let you have your fun. Yeah, I'm just going to keep on going this way. Ooh, scannables. I don't know if I've been here yet. We are going to find out. And that actually looks like a Cyclops. Cyclops engine fragment here. Seamoth fragment. Hey. One more. One more, and I hope it's nearby. What is this? Bioreactor. Ah, get away, get away, get away. I saw that shadow, and I don't care. Okay, anything else I can scan here before I get eaten? Anything there? No. Just dirt. Oh my god, my sea, my sea glide is out of juice. Oh, hello, Mr. Reefback. I didn't see you up there. I heard you, but I didn't see you. You think with a shadow like that, you'd eclipse everything. Okay, let's fill up my tank. And down we go. Okay, so. There should be something around here. What is that? Oh, uh, could that be part of the sea moth? Probably not. But we will find out. Alright, what are you? Bioreactor? I think I got this one already. Oh, I got the bioreactor. All right, bioreactor. Nothing here. You know, it'd be nice is if when the the reef backs are around, if they actually scared off the the others, like the stalkers and whatnot. I, didn't, I think I checked this one already. Did I not? Yes, I did. Alright, let's go look for, see if we can find that last piece of the sea moth, and hopefully that stalker just leaves me alone. Uh, if I were a sea moth fragment, where would I be? Probably scattered somewhere across the ocean after I blew up. Hopefully not in the big hole there. What do we got over here? Laser cutter. Don't mind if I do. Got the laser cutter. What else we got? I gotta go get some air. Right into a stalker's mouth. Up our game of chicken there, big boy. I'm sure you'd win. Not having a sea glide sucks. Where's my pot? 700 meters away. Alright, well, let's start heading back this direction. Maybe we can find it over here. Somewhere scattered on the seafloor. Oh, more wreckage over here. Big chunk of wreckage. No, I thought I bought. I made the fins. I did. Alright, so they are still pretty slow. But I see some scannables here. And I see somebody that might want to have a part piece of me. That's not a scanner. Nothing in there. Hey, there it is. There it is. Ha ha. Alright. Oh, jeez. Oh my god, you scared me. Uh, if I didn't mention this before, I'm not exactly a fan of the ocean. I can't get in there. 
Uh, metal salvage. We probably might actually need that now. Just because we got a Seamoth to build. Scanner room. I will take that. What else we got here? Uh, Seamoth. Don't need the Seamoth. Salvage. Yeah. Uh, I'll be done in just a moment here. Nothing in there. I can't scan this whole thing, can I? Oh, we got more stuff to scan. Hey, is that the table? Cool. Uh-oh. 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 No. 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 Oh, my God. Whew. All right, let's try this again. All right, where was all that other stuff I saw? Down here. That was a close one. I don't know where you're going, buddy. You can bear yourself and stay out of my way. Thank you. Ah! Sand shark. Yeah, you stay away. You get the hell out of my air face. Alright. Grab a bar table. Gotta have furniture before we get a place to put anything, right? Alright, what do we got here? That's metal salvage. Nothing in there. Anything else? And nothing in these guys. No. And nothing else over here I can scan. No. All right. Well, it looks like it's time to get finally get the sea moth up and running. Do a quick check, see if I can find anything else. And it doesn't look like it. Either that, I'm just too far out of draw range. Ooh, two reef backs. Well, good thing these things are off, uh, passive. At least I hope they are. Alright, well, I got a bit of a swim back to the pod and uh, vehicle bay, which is somewhere over here. Where did my life pod go? There it is. 700 meters, so I'll bring you back. Okay, I am back. Uh, made it back to the vehicle, uh, mobile vehicle bay. And let's see what we need to actually make the sea moth. Titanium ingot, lead, lubricant, and glass. Alright, I can make the titanium ingot. I have the lubricant and the glass. I need to find some lead. So let me uh, hit up some lead and I'll be right back. Alright, I did get the last piece of lead and I think I have everything on me now. I got the lubricant, I got the glass, got the titanium ingot, and there we go. Hey, uh, sea moth. Now don't drop it. I worked hard for that thing. No, I don't think I can actually change color until I get the modification station up and running. Yeah, that's what I thought. So, let's go check out my toy. Hello, hello, hello. So yes, there was inventories. There was act upgrades. Okay. And then, oh, what's that? Oh, you put the power cell on the back. Interesting. And I thought, I thought I had an inventory, or is that an upgrade you have to get for it? Uh, that's what I thought. Uh, I guess I have to actually add a storage module. Right. In we go. Welcome aboard, Captain. Now watch that Captain thing. You might, you might get to my head. All right. It's a shame you can't do a roll or anything. Okay, and he actually gets out of there, out of the moss, so I'll remember that. Alright, there we go. We're finally in a somewhat safer habitat. Uh, we gotta breach it. We gotta breach it. It's a shame there's no third person view. But anyways, I think I'm gonna call the episode here. I wanted to get this thing up and running, and uh... Also wanted to watch the roar explode. We got uh, a lot of shit at the very beginning. Where is it? Where is it? Where are you? 
There you are. Yeah, you can't turn while you're in the air. Uh, there we go. That is it. But anyways, uh, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you didn't, leave me a like, and I'll see you in the next one. Later.